Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you are new around here, hi I'm Madeline and I am so happy that you are here today. Today's video I am going to be doing a what's on my iPhone. I know I don't normally do like tech related videos on my channel but I like watching these types of videos so I just thought I would make one for you guys. I don't really have anything interesting or unique on my phone or whatever. It's just regular apps probably everyone has just gonna show you guys what i have on here i have an iphone xs i want to say does it say on the back still it just says iphone on the back i don't know i know it's an iphone x but i think it's the xs and then i just have a cheetah print loopy case on the back of my phone i am obsessed with loopy i am obsessed with loopy cases i think they are Definitely worth the money, and you can actually look up discount codes for loopy cases. That's what I do. You can get like 20% off with like different influencers and YouTubers' codes. I think they are worth it. I will never own another phone case besides a loopy case. They're so convenient. You can actually set them. Mine's set for a left hand because um, I'm left handed. So I really like them, and I think they are definitely worth it. My favorite phone case ever they actually just came out with a black leopard one i think they called it midnight leopard and i wanted to get it really bad i actually got it for my mom for christmas but i am waiting because i think i'm gonna get a new phone over the summer so i didn't want to spend the money on a loopy to just use it for a couple months so i'm gonna wait till i get my new phone and i think i'm gonna get the midnight leopard it's really cute <laughs> this is my lock screen it's just a picture that me and Ian got done over the summer. This is one of my favorite pictures from what we got done over the summer. Um, these are just what my widgets look like. I don't really have anything like special about the way my phone's laid out. I just feel like um, this is kind of what everyone's phone looks like. So this first one I have up here is a... It wasn't made with Widget Smith. I think it was made with Color Widget, I want to say. And I just got a picture off of Pinterest. It's like a boho looking rainbow and it has the time, the day, the date, and my battery up top. And then over here I have um, my calendar. Oh, I don't want to click on it. I have my calendar and it kind of tells me what I have to do today. It just says that I have to work here in a little bit. And then this first folder is just kind of the basics is what I called it. And let's see, I have my clock, my calendar, my maps, my app store, settings, Safari, Find my iPhone, notes, iTunes store, um, my Gmail app, and then the podcasts app. My dad showed me this podcast. I forget what it's called. It actually should pop up because I've been listening to it. Seven Good Minutes is what it's called. It's a super short seven minute podcast and it's really good. So if you have the podcast app, check it out. Next to that, I keep all of my photo editing stuff and then just my camera app. I have the camera app, photos, Canva, which I use to make my thumbnails, Lightroom, which is how I edit all of my pictures. I've been using Kami Carter presets, but I also have one of Aspen Ovard's packs. I have a Britt Merrill pack, and then I have an Anna Hyde's very first pack that she came up with. I don't use that one anymore, but her new ones are so good so you should check them out i have pix art which i use to make like collages for my thumbnails um this is called mini link it, it goes to my polaroid printer and then this is the retouch app where you can like edit stuff out of pictures and then down here this is my money folder it has my banking app venmo paychecks i think is what it is yeah paychecks which is how i get paid at my job now the Starbucks app for obvious reasons, the Duncan app that I don't use because it needs downloaded, Sheen, or however you say that, Sephora, Ulta, Suntan City, PayPal, Amazon, I need to delete this app, I use it way too much, the Wallet app, Verbo, which is like a, a website slash app, obviously, because this is the app form of it, where you can like book houses for vacation and stuff. We're going on vacation this summer, so I have this because that's what our house is on. FabFitFun, Etsy, Lululemon, Peach Pistol, and the Chipotle app. I actually just got the Chipotle app and I really like their reward system, so you should check it out if you really like Chipotle. And this last folder is where all my social media is. I have Snapchat, Pinterest, Facebook, Spotify, Netflix, Visco, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, 
Facebook Messenger, Octoly, which is an app I have that helps me get brand deals and stuff. Parlor, which I never use. I could never get the hang of it. I don't know. That app was very hard for me to work, so I gave up on Parlor. Stereo. Um, I've been listening to kind of a podcast. I don't know if you want to call it a podcast that um, Cami Carter and Jaden Ashley have been doing about just being an influencer slash YouTuber. And then I have another picture of me and Ian from those pictures we got done and then a picture of me and my dog Winnie because I miss her. And then down here at the bottom I have Messenger, FaceTime, call, phone, whatever you, phone app I guess, and then the music. The next page I just have another little widget up here and I just got this quote off Pinterest and it says she will be known for the boldness of her faith in Jesus. I just really liked that quote. Another little calendar thing that just tells me the day and the date and then I just added this quote that says, life is what you make of it because your girl's been struggling at school and I've been just, I've just been having such a negative, negative mindset about it. So I thought that that was a good quote for me to keep there so I can look at it. Up here, this is my health folder. I have my barcode app, which is how I book my barcode classes and look at my stats and stuff. I have map my run and then this is map my ride. I think this is the biking version of this app. Um, I don't use these very much right now. I use this a lot over the summer. Me and my brother were very into biking, so I had this to track that. And then this is my fitness app for my watch. Then this is my Jesus folder, I called it. I just have my church app and my Bible app in here. This is my YouTube folder. I just have YouTube, YouTube Studio, which is basically how I can like customize my channel, look at my videos, analytics, stuff like that. And then I have TubeBuddy, which just gives me, um, like, the numbers of my channel. I don't know. Those would kind of be analytics, too. But, yeah. This is my school folder, my least favorite folder. I have Canvas, Zoom, Jagline, which is what our bus system is called here. Um, GroupMe, Duo, which is how we log in. I think this is Google Drive. Yeah. I have the Bird app, and then I have the Lime app, which is, like, the scooters that you can ride around. Down here is my utilities where I just kind of throw all my random apps. I have calculator, mail, weather, the health app, contacts, color widgets, I think is what this one's called. Yep. A countdown app, which I didn't know I had. I was actually looking for a countdown app the other day. My period tracker, widget smith, weather bug, Widget Pet. Um, this is called Unfollower. It kind of gives me more analytics on, analytics on my Instagram and stuff. And then my Apple Watch app. And then this app is called Handshake. Um, I need to put this in a folder, but I did a job application through Handshake. It's like a website slash app. And I just downloaded it to look on like the status of my application and stuff. And then this is Face App. I was using this yesterday. Let's see if it pops up what I was doing. I made Ian and I old, you guys. Look. Wait, is that the old picture? Oh, that's not even the old version. I'm gonna find the old version I did. I made Ian and I old because I thought it was funny. But yeah, that's face app. And then over here, I have my widget pet. I, Me and Macy made them and named them after each other. Ignore how dirty this is and it's cracked. Um, this is Macy, my dog. And you just take care of it. Obviously, I don't do a very good job, but then like give it food and stuff it's just it makes you watch ads for like everything so I don't like to use it then I have this batteries thing it gives me the battery on my phone and my watch this is the fitness app that goes with my watch I haven't been up very long so that's why my numbers are so low but yeah just gives me all that my step count how many miles I've gone flights of stairs all the stuff that your Apple Watch gives you and then this, how many steps I've walked. I have this app, or it's not an app. This widget shows me how many steps I've walked, and I have my goal set to 10,000. So then it just kind of shows me my progress throughout the day and watches me get to 10,000 steps. So that is all that I have on my iPhone. I hope this video was kind of interesting. I feel like I just have pretty basic standard apps like everyone else does. I don't know. I just like these kinds of videos, so let me know if you liked it. 
Um, if you did, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment down below, and subscribe to my channel, and make sure you hit the notification bell so that you don't miss an upload from me.